Yo guys, before we do get into the Foot Champions gameplay, if you guys do want some cool, funny, inspirational hoodies, t-shirts, some phone accessories and outdoor accessories, go check out Highline Gears, I'll leave the link in the description. Yo guys, it's your boy Gaming GT and today I'm here with Manchester United Past and Present Episode 3. Now guys, I am playing the Foot Champions Weekend League for these two episodes. I will be do I, I will be playing 20 games this episode. Um just because I can't bother to continue playing um 10 games, editing it, 10 games, editing it, 10 games, editing it, 10 games, editing it. Because it does take a lot of time and it does and it it does get a bit stressful um having to commentate four times. I might as well just do it twice. So I am going to be doing um 20 games this episode and 20 games next episode and remember guys last episode i did promise you guys i will be getting um gold one weekly and gold one monthly you guys will have to stay until next episode to actually find out if i do get gold one or maybe elite three you guys will just have to find out now i do win my first game two nil guys um it looks like the the first loss the the first loss of the weekend league curse has actually gone guys because I am I'm actually winning my first my first two my first my first two to three games I'm actually winning them guys I really don't I really don't know how because at the beginning of FIFA I was always always losing my first to two games I don't know why and it's like and it's like I have the exact same team as I did have at the start the only difference is that I have Pogba and um, Pogba and Rooney because I used to have Rashford and everyone else, but I always used to lose my first game. I don't know why. Maybe I've just improved in F at FIFA, or or maybe I'm just getting lucky. Not really sure. Now in our second game, guys, I do win two one. Bashiri does seal the deal. I did make a few subs because Rashford Rashford was just too weak, so I did have to sub on Bashiri, and we do go into bronze two. Now in the next game, guys, this. Guy's team is an absolute madness. He has a Spanish legend. He has Laudrup. He has Petit. Pulls goals. Pele. Inform Ronaldo. Does have I think Des Desai. He does have um, Barassi, Roberto Carlos, Schmeichel, and I think that's Z Zaretti. I don't, I don't really know the right back's name. But in the 45th minute, just before half time, guys, Herrera back passes it to Pogba. Pogba with an absolute belt over goal to make it one 0 in the 45th minute, guys, and somehow we actually win. We actually hold out. Against a guy with 10 legends. 10 legends. He, he even had Pele and Inform Ronaldo. And and I think he did sub on um, Suarez. But I'm not really sure what Suarez it was. It could have been a team of the year Suarez or just a normal Suarez. Or maybe he's Inform. But guys, we actually beat Pele and Inform Ronaldo and 10 other legends. That's, that is actually a madness. And then we come up against this guy's team. Somehow... Somehow this guy scores in the second minute. He literally just glides past Bailey. Don't know how he does it. Then we come back in the twenty first minute to make it one more with Memphis to pie. Now this guy gets a free kick Christian Eriksen. Look at Begovic's positioning. What is he doing? What is Begovic actually doing? The ball literally went straight at him. In my opinion, I fully think the ball actually went through Begovic's gloves because I did look at the replay and I fully think it actually went through his gloves. Now after that goal, guys, I was a bit frustrated with that goal because that was such a stupid goal to concede, and I was lunging in, and he does make it four-one with Ericsson, and somehow, somehow I lost that game. After that game, I did go off. Um, it's not like I deserved to win that game. I just. I just didn't take my chances, and this guy took all four of his chances. I just didn't take all of my chances. Now, I did take a break. I was really, really pissed off. I I took a break, went to go watch a movie, went to bed. I actually did sleep um, after that game because I was really pissed off. And we come back into our next game, guys, and this guy does make it 1-0. Somehow, um, I get the ball Pogba, Pogba. Shoots that just deflect off his player to make it 1 0 in the 41st minute. Now, in the 44th minute, guys, just literally three minutes, three to four minutes later, um, Valencia passes it to Rashford. Rashford cuts inside, passes it to Herrera. Herrera does find the back of the net just before half time to make it 2 1. Now, in the 65th minute, um, Her um, Mikatarian passes it to Rooney. Rooney does um, a low driven pass. I think that's what it's called. A low driven pass. And it does hit off his defender. And it does go in to make it 3-1. And to be honest, 
I I really don't think I deserve to win that game. I really don't think I deserve to win that game, but somehow I did win, and I will take that win because it is the weekend league, and and um, and you just you just have to accept all the cheese you get. You have to accept you have to accept all the bullshit you get. So I did accept it. Now this guy does get a penalty in the 39th minute, and he does convert it. I did get a penalty before this guy, but um. But he he's um Schmeichel, I think he had Schmeichel. He did save it and somehow Ben Yedda is bodying Pogba to the floor. Ben Yedda is bodying Pogba to the floor somehow and he does make it 2 0 with Martial. Now I am I have got the ball with Pogba. Pogba bodying off Kyle Walker, getting past Smalling and he does slot it straight past the keeper to make it two one in the forty fifth minute just before half time. And in the 79th minute, somehow Smalling, Smalling is just there at the right time and Begovic does hit it into his own net. And he does make it 3-1 in the 73rd minute and I do lose that game and that guy deservedly, he, he deservedly to win that game, I, I don't really know, he, he, deser- he deserved to win that game to be honest. Now this guy has a 4-3-3 false 9, does have a Burnley League team, he does have Douglas Costa, Bellarabi, Draxler, I think he had Gutsy in there as well. Now... I put Rashford in um in this clip because I told him to shield, but for some reason Rashford wants to run around the defender. This guy goes on a counter attack, and Douglas Costa is there to get the rebound to make it one 0 Now he does get a penalty. I knew where he was going, but but um Begovic does dive over the ball, and he does make it two 0 in the thirty fifth minute. Now in the seventieth minute, Pogba with the ball, Pogba. Shoots and that was an absolute belt of a goal from Pogba to make it 2 1 in the 71st minute. But unfortunately, guys, I couldn't make the comeback and I do lose my second game. I think, no, my my third or second game of this episode. I th- no, my, my third game of this episode, yeah. Now, I did come up against this guy 4 3 1 2 formation, just have Rooney, Vardy, Gray, Matic, Kante, and Dembele. Now, in the 33rd minute. Mkhitaryan passes it to Rashford. Rashford finds the back of the net to make it 1-0. Now, um, in the 62nd, 60, 62nd minute, Gray somehow just bulldozes Chris Smalling, sends him to the floor. Ref doesn't call a foul and just make it 1-1. Now, Rooney with an awful touch. Kante dispossesses him. Passes it straight to Gray. And he does make it 2-1. And I do lose that game. And our record is 4-4-4. Four for four. 4-4-4, four for four, guys. This is the worst I've ever played since the start of the Weekend League. It's actually really, really poor. Now, the next game, this guy does have a 4-3-3 four, four, three, three formation um, Premier League side. I play over top through ball. Poor pass. That was meant to be for Pogba. But for some reason, Herrera plays it to Rashford. But Rashford does not give up. Tackles him. And he does finesse his straight pass Courtois. Now, in the 33rd minute, Herrera plays, plays it to Rashford. Rashford, for some reason, just hits it straight at Courtois, but luckily Ander Herrera is there to get the rebound, and he actually nearly missed that, I don't know how we actually nearly missed that, but we do score nonetheless, now um, Rashford does turn the defender to make it 3-0, and um, I did miss a goal, I, I don't know how I actually missed the goal, I must have misedited or something like that, but um, we do make it 5 in the 62nd minute. Now, in the 73rd minute, Mkhitaryan does make it 6-0. And this guy was, um, every time he got the ball, he always passed it back to his keeper and he started going on a run with him. So, he was messing about after, like, the 4th or 5th goal. So, I decided to mess about with Begovic. I, I get past two defenders, but unfortunately, I do get tackled. I tried to pass it out with Herrera, uh, Mkhitaryan, but I he does intercept it. I he does score with... with he does score with Cantinho to make it 7-1. And I deservedly, um, I deserve to win that game. And we are in bronze 1, guys. Now this guy does have a 4-3-3. Three, three. La Liga Santander side does have Benzema. Um, Pada Futre, um, Bale, Informisco, Modric, Iniesta, Alba, Sergio Ramos, Varane. I think that was Navas and Info Montoya. Now, he, I do make it 1-0 in the 17th minute with Mkhitary. Now, this guy does intercept me. I don't know how because I really don't know how he got that ball through. Because I swear I had Pogba there, but I guess he... 
I guess the ball went through Pogba's legs or something. I'm not really sure. But um, Rashford does make it 2-1. I think that's like the 70 or 63rd minute. I'm not really sure. Now, Paulo Fitre scores an absolute BS goal. Somehow hits off the post and goes in. And he does make it 2-2. Now, um, uh, we do go to penalties. It is 3-3 on penalties. I do convert my penalty with Memphis to pie. He's Paulo Fitre steps up. And he does go straight on the middle. And he, and he does that little stutter thing. I I really need to know how to do that. I don't know how you actually do it, but I think I think yeah, Mikatarian um apparently does get saved. And he is doing that little start thing again. I don't know how you do it, but Benzema does convert his penalty. I do that the wrong way. It does clip off the post and it does go in and he does win this game. He did not deserve to win this game. The stats the stats might say he deserved to win this game. But in my opinion, he he did not deserve to win that game. I deserve to win that game. Um, I should have been six to four, but somehow I'm five for five, guys. This is actually really poor. This is really poor, and especially from my standards, guys. This is absolutely terrible. Now this guy does have a four three three. Um, he does have Ben Yedda. I don't really know what this guy's actually trying to do. He has like a French, a French league of Santander. I really don't really know what he's guy's trying to do. But we do make it 1-0 with Pogba in the 55th minute. He does a fake short split in his defence. And there was only one goal in this game. Um, I couldn't I, I couldn't get another goal. I had my chances, but I just didn't take them. Luckily, we do come out with a win. Now, next game, guys, I just have Legend Fowler. I think that's... Second or third informing Cardi, Deli Ali, Nangolin, Dembele, and Kante. Now, in the 11th minute, I find Rashford literally wide open. He dragged out one of his defenders, and I do make it 1 0 in the 12th minute. Now, I get the ball, Rashford again. Rashford passes it to make a Tarian. Make a Tarian slots it straight past the keeper to make it 2 0 in the 47th minute. Now, make a Tarian play an over top through ball to Pogba. Pogba chests it down, somehow beating his defender and pokes it straight past the keeper, hitting the post, and it does go in to make it 3 0. Now, this guy was stopped playing, but I did want to make sure I did win this game, so I sweated it straight to Memphis to pie to make it 4 0 in the 66th minute. And this guy was actually a foot founder guys this proves that um not all foot founders are actually good at the game this guy was not a good player this actually does um justify that not all foot founders are good but um i actually didn't know i was playing a foot founder because of the new patch that ea released where it doesn't show the establishment of the um opponent now in this game uh i didn't know what to do with smalling i didn't know whether to cover the run i didn't know whether to deflect the the shot but that is poor defending by me because I could have controlled Bailey or something so we, we do lose that game 1-0 now in this game guys this guy does have a Premier League side he does have storage Danny Welbeck Deli Ali Fernandinho Kante Herrera Klein Smalling Mustafi I don't know who the left back is but they have Butlin in goal and Daniel Sturridge rising over Valencia, Valencia stood there like a wooden plank, don't know what he's doing, so this guy's on the fast break in the 41st minute, look at Luke Shaw, Luke Shaw's positioning is absolutely awful, he can clearly see that Daniel Sturridge is splitting through both of them, but for some reason he's still, he's still trying to cover, cover his side instead of covering Smalling. And I do lose that game 2 0. And we are 7 for 7, guys. It's absolutely awful. So, um, I must have taken a break. I must have gone to sleep. And I was thinking while I was in bed, let me change my formation to the 4 3 3 false 9 because, because I play a shielding game. So, Rashford isn't as strong. So then I decided to play Pogba centre forward because he can shield. Pogba's actually strong. And in his first game of playing centre forward, guys, he scores two goals straight off the back uh, he did score the first one with the finesse he's got the second one with the finesse he does make it two in the 32nd minute now straight off kickoff guys this guy passes it straight to um straight to the pie the pie person german getting past one he does get lucky with the skill ronaldo ronaldo chopping to get past another defender and finesses it straight past his keeper that was it was kind of a skill goal it wasn't a skill goal but it was it was a good goal nonetheless and he does rage quit straight after that goal guys. And um this amount of coins I de I deserve to win that game, obviously he did he did rage quit, but for some reason it said I had two shots and 
two shots on target when I scored three goals. So I don't know what um I don't know what EA is talking about. I think they may have to fix that, fix that glitch or something, because they absolutely misread what the game, what um, what ha what actually happened in the game. Now in this 66 minute, guys, I don't know how I actually did that skill because I see professional um FIFA players do that skill. I don't know how I actually did it. I think that's like precision dribbling something, but I'm not really sure how you actually do it. But I do do it with the pie and I do score. Now I do get the ball with Ramsey. I did have to sub um. I subbed Rooney, Fellaini and Herrera out because they're always dead at like the 70th minute and it does um, kind of annoy me because the, their passing does get sloppy and whenever they're running through on goal they're always really too slow to actually get the ball so I do have to sub in Ramsey, Bashiri and and Dembele so I did keep some players even though, even though they're not for Man United I still um I still just kept some Premier League players. Now in the f in the fifth in our next game in the fifth minute I d I think that was a shot. That wasn't a low driven a low driven pass. That was actually a shot. I don't know how the pie actually. I really don't know how he actually could shoot like that because that is actually poor shooting. I really don't know how. But somehow Mkhitaryan misses a one-on-one -on -one low driven shot. The pie gets the ball. I cross it to Mkhitaryan. And Mkhitaryan does make up for that one-on-one -on -one miss. And I play over to over the top through ball to Pogba. Pogba bodying off Smalling. A cross goal shot. To make it 4-0 in the 70th, 70th, 70th minute. Pogba doing his, um, his celebration. The dub celebration. I do have 10 wins and 7 losses, I think that is. Now, this guy does have a Premier League side, but he has Lacazette out front. I'm guessing he had Lacazette out front because he wanted to have some pace up front. And he couldn't bother to get Rashford because Rashford isn't he Rashford isn't the best of players. Um, Yeah, Rashford, Rashford isn't the best of players. Now, Herrera does make it 1-0. I could have sweat that to make a tar, and I think that was with the pie, but I decided to go with the safe option because his defender was there. And Herrera once again scoring to make it to make it 2-0 in the 74th minute. But for some reason, that didn't count as no one got that counted as Herrera's goal for some reason. I don't know why, but literally five minutes after that, Ramsey straight off the bench to make it 3-0 in the 79th minute and I do win that game. Nine shots and six on target. I am 11 for seven now guys. I'm getting in the rhythm of winning. I'm not getting rid of I'm not getting in the rhythm of losing anymore. I'm not I'm not frustrated anymore. I'm not um I'm constant I'm concentrating more. So I am getting more wins. Now in this next game, uh, in the thirteenth minute, Herrera once again, straight through to make it 1-0. Herrera was really, really good. These these two episodes that you're going to see, Herrera actually did perform. There was once he actually saved us because we actually nearly lost. But that will probably be in the next episode. I'm not really sure. Now, in, um, in the, we did go into extra time in this game. And Insigne, he did sub him on. There's, there's, there's really nothing I can really do about this one. Insigne just paced straight through my team. I don't know how he scored from that angle. With Gale, I really don't know how he scored from that angle, so I might have to buy David the Hell when I get my rewards. I'm not really sure. I might do um, a poll next episode, but Begovic really does need to work on his reflexes and his diving because that was absolutely poor. Now I come up against this four-three-two-one side. This guy's team is really good. Just have info Mane and Aguero out front, and I power I power pass it to Pogba, and Pogba does make it one 0 in the fourteenth minute. Now I do get the ball, really, really shielding off the defender, passes it straight to Pogba, and Pogba does low driven shot it to. Make it 2 0, and that is the end of the game. I had 10 shots, 9 on target. I really got around the match. Pogba scored both of the goals as centre forward, guys. And I did say Pogba is really good centre forward. He, um, he has the strength to, to shield, he had the strength to body off the defenders. And in my opinion, I think he has the pace. He's probably better than Benzema centre forward, in my opinion. I really think he's better than Benzema centre forward. But guys, we do have twelve wins, eight losses. We do have. I was playing this on a Sunday night. Um, Seventeen hours left to go. Twenty games remaining. Can we get gold one? Can we get thirteen more wins, guys? Out of twenty games, you guys will find out next episode. Don't forget to hit the like button. Don't forget to comment and work with my videos. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button. 
and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.